This is our healthy eats edition. And this is the one part about being home that I really love. I really, really enjoy my mom's cooking. And so she always packs me this cute little lunchbox that I will be eating today. So we got two things here. We'll start with this. Not sure what's in it, but usually it is some combination of vegetables and meats. So we have some radish, some cabbage, jalapenos, some seaweed, One of the things you always want to do is eat your vegetables first. By doing so, it aids the digestive process. Something I forgot to do is take my amino acids. Oh, I got snot coming out everywhere. One thing I also do is I mix it with other supplements that I usually have to take because I don't like carrying around so many different bottles. But we're gonna use chopsticks to make sure we get all of these bad boys. And then this handy dandy water bottle that I carry around. I feel like I'm at a funeral. With this bag of music in the background. So we just got done playing tennis, which is a really great exercise. I almost feel a little guilty for whatever reason. I got two really, really good workouts in without any sort of mental fatigue. And I don't know why that makes me feel guilty. Because usually, just one workout has me mentally drained. So, my brain doesn't even Except the fact that I'm this tired without any sort of mental stress. Alright, we got tofu. I have no idea what this is. We got fish. Great for your omega-3s. Ow. Tofu is a great source of protein. Lean. Red pepper. Anchovies. For the longest time, I didn't know what these were called in English because they're called melchi, melchi in Korean. No, chicken. We got a hard boiled egg. This was use some hot sauce flavoring, which is why I'm gonna eat it with the veggies. All fermented. I wonder if this will make a good thumbnail. 
kind of gross because I have so much food in my mouth. Hmm. This is truly the unfiltered version of me, which is a bit. nerve-wracking knowing that this will be out for anyone to consume but now I feel like we're in an age where authenticity is super important Unrelatability. I don't know why, if it's the position I'm in, but anytime I eat in the car, I get hiccups. And boy, this person can play the bagpipes. In the comments, I'd love to hear what people want to see more of. I guess I'll do a little reflection on my time in LA, which has been short. I flew in from New York on Sunday. I leave for Korea tomorrow, Thursday morning. And then I head to Bali for a month and Here's my reflection. To a certain extent, you can do whatever you want. And whether these are self-imposed narratives or narratives that we've been conditioned to follow, I think it's important to constantly seek an authentic way of living that serves you, that supports you. And that's what I'm currently doing and I feel so blessed, so lucky, and so happy. So, My iPhone <clears throat> ran out of battery while I was recording tennis, but I'm going to delete some stuff, so it doesn't impede my use. Anyways, follow along, 
the vlog, for which I will also be recording all the things that I did today. So with that, thank you all so much for tuning in. This is our Healthy Eats vlog, so hopefully you guys are enjoying this. Basically, it's all the foods that I eat to stay lean, hopefully year-round, that has high, high protein, low calorie relative to the volume, high fiber, a lot of probiotics. Um, yeah, always managing against blood sugar level as well. So, this is my first meal of the day 12.45. Anyways, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.